Here I'm is. I snuck around the side of the fence. You know, the gate there that I... I stop at. And ducks down the other end, see him? Yeah, I'm not going anywhere near the tall grass. Well, that's not there. All I got to do is mow it. But don't forget, I think somebody told me that that sod farm, the guy got booted because of something or other. Yeah, he got booted because he screwed something up. You know, someone trying to get slip the system. You know, like every corrupt politician that there is. Oh, I should say every politician there is is corrupt. Oh, freaking word, man. Uh, it's just like the police. You got one guy that you're telling him, one cop, that you're telling him what your rights are, and he calls for backup. And every backup agrees with the first cop. In fact, they will all jump on your pig pile. This is the grass they had here last year. I bet it looks good, nice and short. I don't know what that stuff is, though. Yeah, that tall stuff. But if you get a pig pen of a cop, which is what they'll do, you know, one cop calls for six. Because they're scared of the safety. That's what I see. That's what I see. Scared of their safety. Yeah, they got bad people out there, but some of them aren't worth a shoot. My freaking word, man. Are you kidding me? Oh, we were going into his car, so I had to shoot him seven times. Wow, you were standing at that wall with your hands tied behind your back with a blindfold on. I had to shoot you. People make me sick. And that's what I see. Uh, that's what I watch. I, I see some good cops out there that will uh, honor, but the rest of them are jumping into the pig pile. Agreeing with the first, second, third, fourth, every man in the group, they all agree with one thing. Let's hang this guy that we just got handcuffed on, kind of thing. Whereas the politicians do the same thing. Oh, there's one, two, maybe a dozen, dozen, two dozen congressmen that are real good people and are trying to make the system change because they know what it is. And they can't because the majority rules. And right now, it's a, I think in the, the House, it's a Democrat rule. And in the Senate, it's a Republican rule, I think. Well, that's what's wrong with our country. Either you agree or you disagree. No ifs, ands, or bucking butts. Because that's all you people do down there is, oh, well, I don't like it because, oh, well, I only got 10000 from Al over here. He kind of chipped me, so I'm going to vote for it instead of against it. That kind of shit. Oh, but wait a minute, never mind. I'm going to vote against it because uh, I got another 20000 from uh, Fred Mertz over here. Are you kidding me, people? That's my government? And yet we got people that are going hungry? No education? And now they want to vaccinate us for the rest of our eternity? Once you start vaccinating people, well, you do so three few things, but once you start vaccinating for viruses, the next virus is a different one. The next virus is one that you have to have a new antidote for. And that's the thing. It just goes on and on and on and on and on. Well, what can I do? I just go through the system and do as best as I can. Yeah, do as best as I can. I, I made it through a uh, working career. And you know why? Yeah, read my shirt. That's what it says. I am a uh, New Englander. Been here for uh, as 70 years. 
and eh, wicked piss off, baby. Wicked fucking piss off. <laughs> Just like the Sam Adams commercial where uh, the guy's from Boston and he's just a hoop. Yeah, he comes out and he's right up there. It's a commercial for Sam Adams beer. And he says stuff at a wedding and <laughs> kind of odd but good. That kind of stuff. Wicked pissa. Alright, I'm out for a ride today. When my honey and I left, or not left, but I think just before we went shopping, uh, it was 88. It had come down from 90. Because I noticed it 10 minutes before that. 88 when we left the house. And we come home, and eh, maybe an hour later. Yeah, maybe an hour later. 93. Wow. The, sea, the last two seasons we've been having are strange as can be. I have always had snow in Connecticut and Massachusetts. I remember as a kid in Massachusetts for well, a couple of years. Playing out in the snow, I think I got pictures. Oh, I had a video camera in my hand back then. <laughs> no. I was still handsome. That was a cute baby. Oh, shit, yeah. Can't you tell? Everything about me is cute, man. I know. So I've always seen snow. Well, this year we didn't get but six inches for the whole season. We usually get something in November. And maybe a little bit, not much, uh, going into March. Uh, I should say, uh, close to spring. This year we had the six inches of that maybe. Yeah, I think it was three or, or four snowfalls that added up to six inches. And now this summer, it's been, well, it was wet until a certain time and then boom, drought and dry out. Uh, I've been drying out for about three weeks. They dried up. Everybody's got water, but the lawns are all <laughs> green and brown. Oh, well, Gary, I told you this came before. Remember the other day when you looked at that video and you were making all kinds of air noises? Oh, shit, I can't talk over that. Look at this overgrowth. Come on, Brooklyn, let's go. I know, you don't want to get in the truck because it's so hot. So anyway, it's a hot summer. Let's put this in a, how warm it is out at this summer. Uh, in the last 10 years, I may have slept on top of my bed covers on top of my bed covers. Any other time it might be, you know, the blanket or the sheet. But I have slept on top of the bed for three months. No blanket. It's underneath me. Just me and my underwear and my kitty. Yeah, really. That's warm. Now my house is uh temperature giver is off. The roof is sore and I should get a free roof for that. Yeah, three people watching my video. You think most likely they don't need a roof. Gary, you suck. I don't know. So I'm headed down here. I don't know why, I don't know where. And I really don't want to go that way. But I may just
just not want to, but I don't want to go up in and go either. Let's turn around and go back down the hill. Okay. truck was backing out of the driveway and I don't know what truck it was it stopped so I went around it. You got a signal. Yep, wanna go that way. Wow, oh, it's really blowing right at me. Yeah we're right in the middle of the field, that's why. It just changed. So anyway my sister is in my sister-in-law is in our Kansas. And they're gonna get whacked with it. Slow down. They're gonna get whacked with a hurricane in a day or so. Hey there, hey there. 